I am Lisa DiCaro. I'm playing Mrs. Gibbs. She is married to Doc Gibbs. They have two kids, George Gibbs and Rebecca Gibbs. And she's played by my daughter, Ella, which is awesome. Here, chick, 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 chick. Now, what's the matter with you? Fighting, nothing but fighting all the time. Huh. You're not one of mine, where'd you come from? A little quiet and simple and fabulous, and she's fabulous. So Mrs. Gibbs has been with Doc Gibbs since they were in high school, and they've lived in this town their entire lives, and she wants to travel, she wants to go somewhere where they don't speak English and don't even want to. But Doc Gibbs is convinced that if he leaves Grover's Corners, he might not be as happy in Grover's Corners when he comes back, so he won't go anywhere. Myrtle Webb, he offered me $350 for Grandmother Wentworth's high boy. Do you? Kids? As I'm sitting here, he did that old thing. Why, oh, it was so big, I didn't know where I was going to put it. I almost gave it to Cousin Hester Wilcox. Well, you're going to take it, aren't you? I don't know. You don't know? $350? What's come over you? Well, if I thought that I could get the doctor to take the money and go on a real trip somewhere, I would sell it like that. Everybody should have to see this play on a yearly basis to remind us of why things that we all know are important really are important and how easy it is to lose sight of that. You can't get a more warm and, and hopeful and optimistic two hours than seeing this play. Um.